Diversity's Jordan Banjo, 30, spoke about his nerve-wracking experience taking over from Greg Wallace in an exclusive interview with Express. Co.uk. The KISS radio presenter, who first got his start on Britain's Got Talent in 2009, discussed his BBC presenting gig in a wider interview about Food Waste Action Week earlier this month. Jordan took over from Greg when he left his presenting job on the popular BBC show Eat Well for Less. The star has joined Chris Bavin on the informative show, which helps families make smarter choices in their weekly food shop. Greg made headlines on Monday when he revealed he will stop presenting yet another BBC show, Inside the Factory, in order to help take care of his three-year-old son, who has been diagnosed with autism. However, fans will be relieved to hear the BBC has confirmed he will continue to judge their famous cooking competition, MasterChef, alongside co-presenter John DeRode. Given Greg's huge TV presence, Jordan admitted it was daunting taking over from the star, but credited the Eat Well for Less team for being so supportive despite his initial fears. Do you know what? It was a bit nerve-wracking taking over from Greg, Jordan admitted. The show has got such a core fan base. And it's a show that I, to be honest, kind of jumped at because I'm a big fan. I watched it a lot. My mom and my family watch it. It's kind of one of those staple shows, right? E12 for less addresses the issue of rising food prices, looking at how they are affecting both finances and eating habits, and explores whether it is possible to buy food on a lower budget without compromising on quality. It might not be the most glamorous thing in the world, Jordan continued. It might not have the glamour of Strictly. But it's the sort of show where you go eat well for less and everyone goes yeah, I've seen that. And because people actually use it for information, actually use it to take some advice, I did feel a lot of pressure stepping into Greg's shoes. Jordan went on to note that the kindness co-star Chris showed him when he joined the show made taking over from Greg a lot easier. So initially it was scary but Chris Bavin, who I presented with, is just the coolest, nicest guy ever, he said. The whole team on there was really, really nice. I had a great time filming it. And it was quite tough with KISS, radio, because sometimes you'd be helping a family eat in Scotland. So I've finished my KISS job and I've got to get to Scotland and get back for the next morning, which was quite tough. So some of the scheduling made it a little bit difficult, but in terms of the show, I'm enjoying it. I'm very happy to do it and I was very proud to be on it. Jordan added that he would love to still do the show in any of its future seasons after his positive experience. Jordan has teamed up with Love Food Hate Waste to encourage families around the UK to waste less time and money by freezing leftovers and preparing meals that can be enjoyed more than once. We're wasting two and a half days cooking food that just gets wasted and not eaten, and when I heard that I just thought that is a huge amount of time, he explained, before later adding of the campaign, you're saving time and money, so it's sort of a win-win. For more information on Food Waste Action Week and to find out what you can do to reduce the food you waste at home, visit the Food Waste Action Week website at Love Food Had Waste. Com slash flaw.